The Chuvash people, Chuvash, C Vas IPA, T, A, Russian, Kuvasi pronounced T, Va, are a Turkic ethnic group, native to an area stretching from the Volga region to Siberia. Most of them live in the Republic of Chuvashia and surrounding areas, although Chuvash communities may be found throughout the Russian Federation. Etymology <inaudible> 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 There is no universally accepted etymology of the word Chuvash, but there are two main theories that try to explain it. One suggests that the word Chuvash may be derived from common Turkic Javas, friendly, peaceful, as opposed to Sarmas, warlike. Another theory is based on the Tabgach, an early medieval Shenbei clan and founders of the Northern Wei dynasty in China. The old Turkic name Tabgach, Tuba in Mandarin, was used by some Inner Asian peoples to refer to China long after this dynasty. Gerard Clausen has shown that through regular sound changes, the clan name Tabgach may have transformed to the ethnonym Chuvash. <inaudible> Origin There are rival schools of thought on the origin of the Chuvash people. One is that they originated from a mixing between the Turkic Sabir tribes of Volga Bulgaria and also according to some researches with local Finno Ugric populations. According to another theory, the Chuvash may be descended from the Volga Bulgars, they have been subjected to much infusion and influence, not only from Russian and Turkic peoples, but also from neighboring Finnic tribes, with whom they were persistently and mistakenly identified for centuries, perhaps aided by the fact that the Chuvash language is a highly divergent form of Turkic, and was not easily recognized as such. Chuvash is classified, alongside the extinct Bulgar language, as the only remaining member of the Oguric branch of the Turkic language family. Topic genetics Physical anthropologists using the racial frameworks of the early 20th century saw the Chuvash as a mixed Finno Ugric and Turkic people. In surveys of mitochondrial DNA, mtDNA, haplogroups J2 mostly J2A and E are most common among the Chuvash, followed by N and R1A. Subclades of Y DNA haplogroups R1 and N are most common among the Chuvash. According to Rootsi et al., 2004, Tambits et al. 2004 79 samples and Trofimova 2005 43 samples the following distribution of haplogroups is obtained i1 7% i2a2 0 to 2% i2a1 0 to 2% j1 0 to 2% j2a 0 to 9% j2b 0 to 5% q 0% r1b 2 to 4% r1a 28 to 32% n1c1 18 to 19 N1C2, 9 percent n one c 2 9 to 10 percent em 78 0 to 14 percent c 0 to 1 percent haplogroups q and c are rare among chuvashes chuvash carriers of haplogroup r1a 19 percent in hundreds of samples are balto slavic z282 subclade a study sampling of unrelated 96 chuvashes concluded earlier genetic research using autosomal dna markers suggested a finno ugric origin for the chuvash this study examines non-recombining DNA markers to better elucidate their origins. The majority of individuals in this sample exhibit haplogroups H 31%, U 22%, and K 11%, all representative of Western and Northern Europeans, but absent in Altaic or Mongolian populations. Multidimensional scaling MDS was used to examine distances between the Chuvash and eight reference populations compiled from the literature. Mismatch analysis showed a unimodal distribution. Along with neutrality tests to Jima's D minus 1.43365 p, leaving Chuvash mtDNA largely of Eurasian origin with a small amount of Central Asian gene flow. Their maternal markers appear to most closely resemble Finno-Ugric speakers rather than fellow Turkic speakers. Later, the assertion H, U, and K are absent in Altaic or Mongolian populations turned into virtually absent in Altaic or Mongolian populations. The mtDNA gene pool was found to be 89.1% Caucasoid, 9.1% East Asian, and 1.8% unidentified. According to autosomal analyses, present day Chuvash speak an Altaic Turkic language and are genetically related to Caucasians, Georgians, Mediterraneans, and Middle Easterners, and not only to Central or Northern. Northern Europeans, Chuvash contain little indications of Central Asian Altaic gene flow. 
Thus, present-day Chuvash who speak an Altaic Turkic language are probably more closely related to ancient Mesopotamian Hittites and northern European populations than to Central Asia Altaic people. Finally, an autosomal analysis detected an indication of Oghur and possibly Bulgar ancestry, from which the Chuvashas developed their language. Chuvashas, the only extant Oghur speakers, showed an older admixture date, 9th century, than their Kipchak-speaking neighbors in the Volga region. According to historical sources, when the Anogar Bulgar Empire Northern Black sea steppes fell apart in the 7th century, some of its remnants migrated northward along the right bank of the Volga River and established what later came to be known as Volga Bulgars, of which the first written knowledge appears in Muslim sources only around the end of the 9th century. Thus, the admixture signal for Chuvashas is close to the supposed arrival time of Oghur speakers in the Volga region. Another study admitted substantial Finno Ugric component in Chuvashas, unlike its complete absence in Bashkirs, but noted that some aspects of HLA in Volga Tatars are close to Chuvashas and Bulgarians, declaring the suggestion of Bulgar descent. According to other study of HLA the Bulgar descent of the Chuvash cannot be confirmed and that Bulgarians and Chuvashas are clearly different. Bulgars left for the Balkans, while another subdivision moved to the mid-Volga region and made up the ethnic base of the Chuvash and Kazan Tatars. The Chuvash have a Central European and some Mediterranean genetic background probably coming from the Caucasus. Chuvash and the fifth representing present-day Bulgarians. From the data obtained in the present work, the genetic backgrounds of both populations are clearly different. It is possible that only a cultural and low genetic Bulgar in UENCE was brought into the region without modifying the genetic background of the local population. The Chuvash relatedness to Caucasian Georgians and Middle Eastern people suggests that the Chuvash genetic pool has characteristics from ancient Middle Eastern, Caucasian, and Mesopotamian people. On the other hand, whether the Chuvash are a remnant of the Bulgar hordes cannot be resolved with the data presented in this paper, and further studies are necessary. <inaudible> Subgroups Chuvash people are divided into two main groups Virgil or Turi Chuvash, Viral Turi Upper Anatri, Anatri Lower, which is subdivided into and not Gensi, and not NC mid lower. Herti, Herti step. Topic: History. The Turkic ancestors of the Chuvash people are believed to have come from central Siberia, where they lived in the Irtish Basin between the Tian Shan and Altay from at least the end of the third millennium BC. In the beginning of the 1st century AD, the Bulgars started moving west through Zedizu and the steppes of modern-day Kazakhstan, reaching the North Caucasus in 2nd-3rd centuries AD. There they established several states Old Bulgaria on the Black Sea coast and the Sawar Duchy in modern-day Dagestan. Old Bulgaria broke up in the second half of the 7th century after a series of successful Hazar invasions. Some of its population fled north, to the Volga Kama region, where they established Volga Bulgaria, which eventually became extremely wealthy, its capital being the fourth largest city in the world. Shortly after that, the Suvar Duchy was forced to become a vassal state of Khazaria. About half a century later, the Suvars took part in the Arab Hazar Wars of 732-737. It is believed that the Chuvash people came in strong contact with Iranian tribes. Culture They speak the Chuvash language and have some pre-Christian traditions. In addition to Chuvash, many people also use the Russian language. Religion Today Chuvash people are Eastern Orthodox Christians and belong to the Russian Orthodox Church. They retain some pre-Christian or pagan traditions in their cultural activities. Topic Gallery. Topic See also. List of Chuvashes. Chuvash Wikipedia. Chuvashtit. Chuvash National Museum 
Society for the Study of the Native Land Chuvash National Congress Chuvash State Academic Song and Dance Ensemble Chuvash National Symbols <laughs>